Optoelectronic materials have been known for nearly a century. In the late years, the interest in this material is attribute to the discovery of electroluminescence in molecular crystals and conducting polymers. Due to the significant improvements in material design and purification, the field of optoelectronic materials has caused great interest. At present, organic materials have received considerable attention due to their application in electronic and optoelectronic devices such as organic thin film transistors, light emitting diodes, solar cells, flexible printed electronics and so on. Disensitized solar cell is low-cost solar cell belonging to the category of thin-film solar cells. It is based on a semiconductor formed between an electrolyte and a photosensitized anode. Disensitized solar cell has many attractive features, it is easy to make use of conventional roll printing techniques, and most of the materials used are low-cost. An electrode is an electrical conductor for making contact with a non-metallic portion of a circuit. Electrodes are used to provide current through non-metallic object and to measure the electrical conductivity for many applications, such as fuel cells, electroencephalography for recording brain activity, electrophysiology techniques in biomedical research and so on. Flexible print electronics combines the microelectronics, electronics assembly and printing industries. This technology makes it possible to print circuits, sensors, memories, batteries and displays onto thin lightweight flexible substrates. An organic light emitting diode is a light emitting diode in which the emissive electroluminescent layer is a film of organic compound that emits light in response to an electric current. The layers are situated between two electrodes. Olds are used in manufacturing digital displays in devices such as television screens, computer monitors, mobile phones and personal digital assistants. Organic photovoltaic solar cells are designed to provide earth-rich and low-energy photovoltaic solutions. This technology has the theoretical potential to provide electricity at low cost. Organic thin film transistor technology involves the use of organic semiconductor compounds, particularly computer displays. These displays have high brightness, vivid colors, and are easy to read in most ambient lighting environments. A perovskite solar cell is the solar cell that includes a perovskite structure compound, in which a hybrid organic inorganic lead or tin halide based material is used as a light harvesting active layer. Perovskite slash silicon tandem solar cells have reached efficiencies above 25% in just about three years of development mostly driven by the rapid progress made in the perovskite solar cell research field. Photonic and optical devices are components for creating, manipulating or detecting light or electromagnetic radiation. This can include laser diodes, light-emitting diodes, solar and photovoltaic cells, displays and optical amplifiers. Other examples are devices for modulating a beam of light and for combining and separating beams of light of different wavelength. OLED has the key advantage that they may be manufactured entirely through solutions, making them more suitable for low-cost, large-area flexible displays and white lighting panels. OLED requires a multi-layer device structure to ensure good performance which includes a transparent and conductive indium tin oxide anode, a hole transporting layer, an emissive layer, an electron transporting layer, and a metallic cathode. Thermally activated delayed fluorescence OLED is proposed as a third generation luminescent material, which can realize the ultimate electroluminescent efficiency by efficient up conversion from the lowest triplet excited state to the lowest singlet excited state through reverse intersystem crossing. 
TADF materials can achieve 100% of the exciton formation generated by electrical excitation at S1.